Yes, my friend, we are live on air. What do you like to say to us? So uh, the topic that you are discussing today, uh, what would you like to say about that? Well, I don't, I don't know. Aren't you watching us live on YouTube? We are live on YouTube. We are talking about your yeah, prophet I, hadith. So you saw the hadith. Yeah, right? you are, you are live on air. So uh, you are not understanding the hadith. You are okay, interpreting strong. Okay, go ahead. Yeah. Uh, so in the hadith, it is said that uh, this dead seed, the black coming, is the uh, heals every disease hmm. except death. Okay. It means that uh, it means that if if there is death in the fate of a person then it cannot be cured by any any remedy or any uh, anything you know so you have to uh, you have to be sure that uh, it is not the death that is coming to you if it is the death that is coming to you then it cannot be cured you know uh, because let let us consider one a person is having a heart attack hmm. and it is in his face it is in his fate hmm. that he will die today hmm. so nothing can cure him nothing can get uh, can get him rid of his death mm. death is for sure and it will come to everyone mm. but my this friend means, my friend why you are adding words is not there are you saying your prophet you speak with arabic did yeah, your prophet, I, I am explaining when, no, no, when no, someone you see, no you are explaining you're explaining what something is not there because your prophet he made it so clear he says that black common or black seed is healing for all diseases let us take a focus on the f first part does this seed really heal all diseases or this is an exaggeration and a lie? Yeah, maybe it, uh, it cures all diseases. You maybe. don't know. So why you Muslims, you go to yeah. doctor, why you don't just go and buy those seeds and that's it. If you have a cancer, buy those seeds, you will be fine. If you have AIDS, buy those seeds and you, have, you will be fine. If you have headache, buy those seeds and you will be fine. I mean, why you go to doctors? Why Muslims are desperate to buy the, the the coronavirus vaccine from around from from countries they are kuffar? Well, just take the the black seed and that's it. Uh, because uh, not all the Muslims know about all the hadiths. My friend, I'm talking uh, about Muslims. Uh, I'm talking about Muslims. Is Pakistan is a Muslim country? Government is a Muslim country. Is Saudi Arabia government Muslim country? Is even Muslim government? Country? So uh, we are talking about Muslims. Why you Muslims? You have a solution for every disease. Why we have a very high average of death in Egypt because of those diseases? Actually, you know, they have a, they have a liver disease, very well known in in Egypt. You know, hundreds of thousand people die every year. So why we don't just take this seed and that's it? If there is a proof of what Muhammad saying, or this is just a fiction. Yeah. Hello. Let your friend talk to you. Let let your friend join you. Is that your wife telling you what to say? So you can hear me? Yeah, I hear you. Yeah, I hear your lips. Yeah. Uh, okay. Hmm. So, uh, so I was saying that uh, uh, actually, uh, not every Muslim knows all the hadiths of Prophet. So it is. Uh, uh, so it is not, not for sure Muslim that the Muslim knows. Not every Muslim knows. I mean, it is just in YouTube, not in not on, in Facebook. It is there for fourteen hundred years. Muslim they speak about it in TV stations, satellite, and no, but every Muslim knows. Yeah, so uh, not every Muslim okay, uh, let me ask uh, you. takes let, the knowledge let of me, Islam. Okay, let me ask you. If you have a teeth problem, can you solve it with this uh, teeth infection? You have teeth infection. Can we stop the infection of our teeth by taking those seeds? Uh, uh, the infection is not the disease. Infection is something infection, else. Infection disease is, is that disease. is... No, infection is a disease because simply, you see, I read in the old Arabic, it says that, that. That means simply you are suffering from something not part of your body. So bacteria is a, is a disease, viruses is a disease, you know, they spread diseases and they are diseased, they, they cause illness, which means anything cause illness. So when you have infection, this is illness. This is not the natural status of the, of the body. If I have an infection in my skin, you know, obviously I have an illness. I have a, a, a damage in my skin and maybe it can cause uh, uh, cutting the arm, cutting the hand, or even your, or your death. You know, somebody have infection in his toes. It might cause even all his body to be to, to die. So this is a this is an illness. 
infection so like this you will also uh, like this you will also say that if we scratch our skin by falling on the ground then we will uh, then that will My be friend, a disease if it is not a disease scratching yourself and feeling in the ground that's not a problem the problem is the bacteria will go in your wound and that will cause infection so don't mix things together you know Muslims always mix things be between hummus and watermelon so I can now do a cut to my to my skin well, like let's say I'm I'm uh, doing some meat work and then I cut my finger that's not the problem that is not a disease but then a disease can transmit into my blood and that cause my death a bacteria can go in yeah, yeah. and can take over my body and my body die so when your prophet yeah, says uh, when the bacteria when the bacteria are uh, about to take over your body you uh, and you eat the black i mean it will uh, it will it will help you but because this, no, uh, this, this you doesn't know, say things. it will help you you see don't make things up it says that it's a cure the healing so it should have 100 percent guaranteed result so if we go to islamic hospital in islam abad we should not have a, a shelf full of medicine we should have one medicine for all diseases do we agree the black seed see uh, somebody have a problem uh, the, you have infection with his liver we give him black seed somebody have a problem with his heart we give him black seed we somebody have a, a problem with aids we give him black seed somebody any, any any disease any disease we should have one one ball on the shelf of every islamic pharmacy no other because it says it clearly for all diseases let the women talk maybe they yes, have better sir. answer than yours because Muslim women are smarter than Muslim men okay uh, uh, you know uh, see uh, these are not meant for the diseases uh, uh, for all diseases black I mean can uh, black I mean can cure every disease uh, so if you will try that remedy then only then you can know you cannot know by okay. the same My friend you are saying yourself. it is not for all so why your prophet says all you see in arabic and no. english is so clear it says kulli kulli da kul kul is every 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 mm. so in english too this is your muslim translation <coughs> says all diseases so why he is saying all diseases if it's not for all diseases <coughs> And you know what? There's not a single disease this this uh, this uh, black seed can solve. That's a lie. Not a single one. It is Those for seed, all no, diseases. No, no, it's, it's for all diseases exactly. So if somebody have AIDS, we give him this seed, he will be fine. No, uh, not th those types of. Uh... It uh, says diseases. all you know, diseases. diseases. Okay, name for me one disease this seed can heal. If somebody have it cholera, is... if somebody have cholera, if somebody have diarrhea, <laughs> diarrhea is not even a disease. I mean, diarrhea, it's, a, it's yes. like, in, you know, maybe bacteria in the food, okay? They, they will not cause your death unless it is severe, like what happened to, uh, uh, what is name, the one who came to be the Messiah, you know, in uh, uh, in Pakistan. Uh, what is his name? Ahmad Mirza Ghulam. He died because of his shit. Excuse my language. You know, diarrhea. He have a cholera. So he keep boo -boo 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 -boo, and then you know he died. And he fell down in the poo, -poo according to the to, to, to the Ahmadiyya. So can this the can this seed really be a solution for any health issue? The answer no. Okay, Christian Prince, you know you have not tried it and you cannot see just the, by, my, just my friend it. my friend this is this is part of our food what are you what you are talking about you don't try it my mom she added to the food this is a food this is a this is the this seed is not coming from the moon it is coming from our land so it, we grow it we grow it, does it. Not we grow mean it we that eat it, it. it we does grow not. it we eat it and people die still people die still people get sick still my mom got sick so we eat it we put it in food we put it even uh, some of them they add it in the drink so this is a lie. We did not try it. We are the one who gave it to you, maybe. I don't know what is what origin of it. Maybe it's coming from India. I have no idea. But to say we did not try it, we have it. Try it. Promise me that you will not go to a medicine pharmacy, and you will buy from Mimi Hijab the seed he sell in his videos, and you will be fine, brother. See, you have to take all the precautions that you can to cure a disease. So this is also one Why of the you precautions. Want to take the precaution? Well, hold on. Don't you trust your prophet words? Isn't it Allah who told him this? 
Yeah, you have to uh, you have to eat it continuously, not only when disease comes. Okay, to eat it continuously, you have to guys. Eat it continuously. Okay, guys, look look how the Muslim poor Muslim try to defend. Did your prophet says you have to eat it continuously? What are you, it says there is a healing in the black cayman for all diseases, which means you take it when you are sick. However, you Muslim eat it every day. Who care? Let us see if you Muslims will have zero disease in your land. Uh, there is never zero there is never zero disease in the land because diseases come in human life it is the part of human life uh, friend, what are okay, you talking about? but that's mean that's mean no human should die and he is taking those seeds correct no no all the human will die because uh, not nothing can the, cure that you, you know, know don't don't be a kid i'm talking to a man no human will die i'm not saying he nobody will die i'm saying from diseases no natural death <laughs> Okay, so natural death can happen, no problem. That can happen to everybody. Actually, I died yesterday. I wake up because I sneeze. According to your prophet, when you sneeze, you die. <laughs> I sneeze every day, which means I die every day, and then I get resurrected again. So here we see that Muhammad, he make no exception except death. And this is stupid to say, because death is not a disease. Secondly, all diseases, and none of them yet, can be solved or fought by this black seed. It's a lie. Uh, it is not a lie because uh, there is a condition that except death, if the if death is to be occurred by the by the disease that you are having, then it cannot be cured. You know, if uh, you have cholera, if you have diarrhea, and you are to die by that disease, then it means nothing can cure it. Not even the black I mean, not even doctor, not n nothing can cure it. So that is why. It doesn't. It doesn't mean that black I mean, is the. So what? Okay. So uh, it doesn't only, mean. Only. So it doesn't mean. But your prophet says all. Is he? Is he an idiot? Is he like? Uh, he don't speak good Arabic. Why he said all? He can say some. You know. Because it, because because it's a healthy because it's a healthy thing. It uh, it immunes our uh, it uh, boosts our immunity. So we should eat it, and it I might be again, the protection. I, I don't understand. Say again. I, I, sorry, I don't understand your accent. Your wife, she is talking, whispering like Jibril. And you are telling me what she say. Why you don't let her talk? Okay, so I'm saying that. Why your prophet says all? Why your prophet says all if it is some? If it is some, there's no some. That's a lie. There's no proof of those some. And it, when he say all, did he make a mistake? You think uh, when there is uh, a certain thing that is uh, beneficial for your health and it cures your voice became low, my friend. Your voice became the low. Disease. Get close to the microphone again. When, so, when certain what? Okay, I'm uh, Is the voice clear now? Yeah, it is. Go ahead. Okay, so I'm saying that uh, if there is something in the land that can benefit you and uh, it can help you cure against the diseases. Uh, let it be all the diseases or some diseases. So you should eat there. So this is what is meant by friend, the you are making me dizzy. What some dollars? Some dollars? Some dollars? Some dollars? I'm asking you. Did your prophet say all or he said some? Yeah, all. Okay. So all mean all. So why you are adding some all diseases? Yeah. Some diseases? Some 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 some? You know, there's no some. So I don't don't fabricate your prophet words. Shame on you, man. You Muslim, you say we protect our religion. And then the second we read something for you, you add like the sun set in murky water. They say the sun appear to the Quran to be aware of that in the Quran. They say we have to add it. So the Muslims, in order to cover up, they change the words. In the top of that, they even change the meaning of the word, and they take the word sometimes. Like what you are doing now, you are taking the word all. You put the word some. No, I, I, I never. Uh did that you did uh, there is the word all for uh, all in the hadith yeah. so it is all okay so why you keep yeah. saying some so, so why it you keep saying some it, to me where the word some no i'm from? just explaining to you i'm just explaining to you when why you, explain you are to using someone, the word some add in the explanation if it does not say some why you are using the word some in the explanation like i say to you take right take left take, you know to go to the direction so why you are using the word some when we are talking go right go left go up stop here why you put the word some there's no some all so when he say all diseases except death that means this is how good it is this is how good it is okay. it's 100 percent 100 percent healing process okay 
see question uh, uh this is not the matter of uh, it is the healing 100 percent healing see it is uh, a matter that is much more uh much more you can say the faith type you know uh, when the lord said to moses that uh, eat from that plant and he ate from that plant and he was cured mm. so uh, what was the, uh, what, the, was the plant, thing, what was the plant was it black seed i don't i don't know okay uh, i uh, i'm telling you the story <laughs> so why your prophet and did not the, to choose that <laughs> why your prophet did not choose that plant you don't know the plant okay uh, just listen just listen uh, you will know uh, and the uh, next time when the moses and uh, moses was uh, uh, moses was uh, moses was having trouble mm. was having the disease oh. he went to that plant and ate from that plant and he was not cured okay, and on. then he asked god hold Allah, on my friend what, yeah. what was the disease uh, he, moses was uh, suffering asked, what was the disease moses was suffering from do you know we don't know the disease okay. it was just is that a disease the disease? is that a di he was uh, yeah yeah, yeah. Uh, I, know, that... I know i know i actually know yeah. it was he was feeling dizzy uh, he was feeling dizzy ah, i know it so, uh, it so not, is, the is, next is, thing is not the disease in his uh, testicles as the hadith says uh, there's no hadith like that well the jews they accuse him that he have a problem in his testicles and he have a disease called hernia i don't know if i'm saying the word correctly you know, if you read the hadith here, this is Sahih Muslim and Sahih Bukhari. It says that uh, Moses was a shy person to take off his clothes. And then the Jews, the children of Israel, heard him by saying, he covered his body, uh, he covered his body in this way, only because he have some defect in his skin, either leprosy or scoral her 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 hernia. hernia. Is that uh, how your uh, prophet uh, he healed uh, oh Allah he healed him he gave him black seed? No, uh, I know this hadith, and oh. then the rock, uh, and then the rock behind which he was taking a bath, the Moses, uh, the rock uh, just uh, go away uh, was what do you mean? pushed what, away what do you mean the rock? by what, what Allah. What do you mean the rock go, go away? What do you mean? What do you mean the rock rock uh, go away? I know this. I know. I know. I know no, this hadith. No, no, Moses was taking from you. The rock go away. The rock go away where? Yeah, the, the rock was uh, pushed aside so that Moses was, was shown to his people and then the people believed that Moses had no No, 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 no. You see, you Muslims, you fabricate very good deal. You, the, the rock was pushed aside. Okay. You have this hadith. You have this hadith. Okay. Show it, show it uh, in okay. the camera. And okay, so in the, hadith it says, it, in the hadith it says that the rock pushed away? The rock pushed yeah, away? Yeah, the, rock, uh, the rock pushed the clothes away. The rock was the rock pushed, pushed away. The clothes away. Clothes okay, clothes. let us read together. It no, says, no. here we go, the hadith the in front of us. The hadith, the hadith, it says, so one day, while Moses was in seclusion, he took off his cloth, clothes and put it on a stone and started taking a bath. When he finished the bath, he moved toward his clothes. So as he, to take them, to take them, but the stone took his clothes and fled, fled. <coughs> You said moved away. This is a different story here. The story says that the stone, she stole the, the, the prophet Moses' clothing, which is very shameful. That's why in the Middle East, never put your clothes in the stones. They are thieves. Now, even the stones in our, in our lands are thieves, not only people. So look at this. The stone... It is not thief. It is not theft. Not theft? The clothes first. Uh, so if I take your clothes and run away with it, this is not a theft? No. Uh, Moses, Moses captured the uh, rock. Yeah, and get the clothes, get his clothes. Yeah, but he got it from the thief, who, who, which is a rock stealing the clothes in the Middle East. The rocks are very thieves. They were very well known. This is, by the way, proven by NASA. So listen. So now the story now. So they, <coughs> they accuse Moses that they have a problem with his testicles, and Allah wanted to heal the testicles of Moses, and He want to show them that the testicles of Moses are very good. So Moses went to take a shower, and then he put his clothing on the rock. And this is something normal to do. You don't want to put them in the sand, you know, because there is like a crab and all that. You know, I mean, you know, you, you can name it, especially in the old days. There's a global warming, a lot of uh, plastic and, you know, in time of Moses. So he put them in the, in the rock and then the rock fled with the clothes and the wallet and the, the iPhone 14 of Moses. What happened next? How in the world the rock is running? Who told the rock to run? No, uh, the rope was, uh, the rope was, uh, see, actually the thing is, uh, the God loved, them, loved Moses, uh, so he couldn't bear that the uh, followers of Moses uh, 
uh, accused him of uh, accused him of something that was not in him so he assured them that it was not in him and after that they the people he, of what do you mean, what do you mean hold on my friend, the you, are, you are speaking so fast what do you mean he showed them did he show them his testicles because they accuse him that he have a problem on his testicles did he like yeah, yeah he, he, he showed, he showed them, them the body he showed them his yeah. testicles not his body, body not his body the testicles yeah ah. So, so that so, so that Allah, the, so, so that Moses okay. cannot be accused of any disease. Uh, so if somebody accuse me of my a disease now, like the Muslims, they can say Christian Prince he have the same disease. So what I should do? I should open the camera and unzip and show everybody that they are lying. This is what your God is doing. Yeah, you can show the show doctor your body. So no, no, why no, can't this is you not show? Doctor. It says here that the rock keep running. Until he arrived. So there might be the doctors in his followers. What doctors? Those are the city. He went downtown. Everybody in the road. He is running in the road, my friend. The rock is running in the road because the road, by the way, rocks in Middle East, they are they don't run in the desert. They run in the rocks. And you know, by the way, you notice here that <coughs> Moses he ran after the rock. He did not he wasn't wasn't surprised. Did you notice that? Like why Moses was not uh, like, yeah. he was he was not shocked. I mean, why it was normal for Moses? Like the rock took his clothes. Shouldn't he say, like, what the heck? Rock is moving? He did not say that. No, he started he, talking to the rock. Because. Yeah, because what? Because because Moses is the person uh, to which the river of Nile was uh, separated. So uh, he, 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 he was, was, was not shocked because, because he knew because Moses that God what? can do anything. So Moses was sure. Moses, that Moses God, was the person. So are you saying that in Islam, Moses was sure that Allah is the one who is stealing his clothes? No, uh, he knew that angels uh, angels are there and angels can do such activities. So, so are you saying that Moses, he was sure that the one is taking his clothes, it was the angels? It was it was not the angels. Uh, the angels pushed the rock aside ah, so that people can see that. The pushed the rock. So why your prophet, he says the, the rock fleed? Why he didn't say the angels fleed with the rock? Why you Muslims always add some adds few add appear to be and now we add the word angels they are moving the rock here it says that the rock fled the rock fled with the with the clothing where's the angels there's angels in the story okay i have a question for you uh does the earth and the heavens are in the obedience of god tell me which god the real god Let's say the who real God. The real God? Give me Are they in okay. Who is that? It is Allah, but How according you know? to you, it is okay. not so. If Allah is God and so, He is the real God, my friend, if Allah is God and He is the real God, so then how Allah, He say to someone, His name is Allah. May Allah forgive the sin of Muhammad. How many Allah you Muslims have? So, first, what? Uh, I don't understand you. You are saying that the real God is Allah. So who is talking here? Chapter, mm -hmm. a victory chapter, chapter 48, verse number two, it says that Allah may forgive thee the fault. Who is talking in the verse? May Allah forgive the, uh, it is the, it is the message of Allah. The Quran okay, is the so, message of Allah. So, so it is the message of you know Allah. Who is, who is talking? Who is talking? Who is the one who is talking? Uh, it is uh, the angel Gabriel uh, was taking the message so the Quran, towards Prophet okay, Muhammad no, hold on, hold on. by Who inspiration. Is okay, hold on, my friend. Listen to me carefully. I want you to focus with me. Or, by the way, take some black seeds so that can help you. Uh, I'm asking, who is the one who said those words? That Allah may forgive your sin. Who is the one who said that? It is the message of Allah, so Allah, uh, Allah, in order to make the prophet understand, I want an answer. Who is the one who said this sentence that Allah may forgive your sin of the past and the future? Who said that? Prophet Muhammad said that uh, because Allah sent the message of this. So Muhammad said that. So this is the message sent no, by Muhammad. Uh, Muhammad? Actually, actually. It is actually the message sent by the Allah, uh, given by the angel Gabriel okay. to so the Prophet one is Muhammad. Talking, so the Prophet one is, Muhammad. Okay, so spoke. now we now we get the conclusion. The Muslims they can't answer any question. They have to go in circle. So <laughs> the one who is talking here is Allah, correct? Yeah. Okay. So how Allah He say me Allah, if Allah is the true God, Allah asking other Allah to forgive you and forgive your sin. 
Who is the other Allah? Me Allah. Allah saying to Allah. Allah saying to other Allah. May Allah forgive your sin. What is that? Uh, you know, Allah teaches uh, His servants uh, how to do dua. So this is one type of dua. Ah, so May Allah, Allah is forgive praying? your sins, your past so and future Allah, sins. So Allah praying to Allah. Allah, Allah is, uh, Allah is uh, dua teaching is a, dua Prophet is a, dua how to is do dua. Dua is a prayer, correct? When you say dua, you say there's many types of yeah. dua, correct? So dua yeah. is a prayer, right? Yeah, okay. yeah it is prayer. So Allah is making dua, guys. So Allah making dua to who? Allah is teaching Prophet Muhammad. What do you mean he how to do dua? This guy is, is, he is saying to him, may Allah forgive your sin. It's not Muhammad saying, may Allah forgive my sin. Allah is making a request saying that may Allah forgive your sins. So Allah make a request from other Allah. See, when the teacher said, when the teacher uh, gives you the lesson about any topic, let it be the topic of science. He tells you that this happens and you have to do this to get to this formula. Uh, see, uh, let, let us consider it is the lecture of chemistry. Hmm. The teacher is telling the students uh, that you have C and uh, oxygen, uh, carbon and oxygen in mm. CO2, carbon dioxide. Mm. So you have to mix these quantities of both of them to mm. make carbon dioxide. Uh. The teacher is guiding the teacher is guiding the student. Mm. Uh, just like that, Allah is guiding Prophet Muhammad how to get his sins uh, mm. forgiven by Allah. Uh. So you should make your brain some, some more abroad brain abroad. yeah you are using your brain abroad, now abroad. so where you get all yeah. this from that allah is teaching muhammad how to pray where it says a pray like this i mean what's wrong with muslim why they have yeah. to add tens of sentences to explain something very simple it says that may allah forgive your sin so there is somebody is talking his name is allah allah is saying to muhammad ask allah to forgive uh, ask me to forgive you no he's saying that may all may that Allah may forgive your sin. This is your translation. So Muhammad is not the one is asking. Allah is the one is saying, speaking to somebody else. His name is Allah, saying that Allah may forgive your sin. And now you are trying to cover up by saying, with well, sometimes that you know they're trying to teach you how to pray. But where it says that it says we give you victory, Muhammad, that Allah may forgive your sin. Does it say there that may Allah teach you how to pray? I mean, Muhammad is already a prophet. This is at the end of his life. Now Allah, he, he, now he, he, he they decide to teach him how to pray. So what is Al-Fatiha then? And what is the, all the chapters in the Quran? So, and the Muslim, they pray five times a day. He was doing what then? So now Allah, he decided by this to teach him how to pray. Where is the word teaching? So Allah speaking, saying, supposedly, the one is talking. We don't know who's he, saying that Allah may forgive your sin. And obviously, I agree with obviously. you. When you said in the beginning, the one who said that is Muhammad. Muhammad, the fabricator of the Quran, he forgot that he should make the Quran as if it's coming from his God. So he said that Allah may forgive your sin. This is cannot be a word coming from God because God don't speak to himself saying such a stupid silly thing. May, and what do you mean by the way? What the, what the Quran is saying may? Is that maybe? Uh, what uh, what the word what the word may stand what for why Allah saying may forgive your sin is Allah not sure I mean Allah who is speaking no, speaking no, to no, other no, Allah no. Uh, so uh, uh, you know first of all everything you said I listen to that now you have to listen to me mm. okay okay I'm listening now so uh, so there's a name of Allah a Rashid uh, which means the righteous teacher so Allah uh, Allah uh, guides the Muslims uh -huh. and orders them orders them the orders uh, which are beneficial for them and he teaches them mm. through Quran okay. through the knowledge and uh -huh. through the angels and through everything mm. uh, 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 that can teach us so it is Allah that is teaching us that how to uh, how to do dua and it is Allah that my is friend, uh, saying my friend, Muhammad, my friend my friend my uh, friend stop stop where you get this conclusion that Allah is teaching us how to do prayer this is Allah talking don't make things up look if you read even the verses after it says and may Allah help you and that Allah may help you who is asking this if you are saying this is Muhammad talking that means the Quran is not the word of Allah it's the word of Muhammad obvious so that Allah may help you uh, so that uh, it is 
So what is the lesson in this? That you must ask help from Allah so that Allah may Our friend, you. the one is talking is, is Allah. Allah. Allah is asking Muhammad to ask help from Allah when Allah is the one who is saying to him, may Allah help you. What's wrong with you? Allah already said to him, may Allah help you. He's not asking Muhammad to say to him, may Allah help me. You see, do you see the word you? Help you. May Allah help you. So Allah, he decide to ask other Allah to help Muhammad. How? Maybe by the black seed. By the way, do you think if we go with the black seed, like we you are black seed, we can up from yourself? Huh? You are making things up from yourself. Send okay. me the verse. Can we read send the, me the can verse? We read the, send me the verse. So are you are reading the verse all this time? You do not know the verse? Chapter 48, verse number 2, verse number 3. Uh, uh, say it again. Uh, chapter number. Oh boy. Chapter 48, verse number 2 and 3. And you can read before it and after it. Okay. I will check it. Okay. By the way, you should use black seed for your door. It's making noise. Obviously, it's having infection, rusting. Uh oh. Oh boy. Where do you go? I hope he did not listen to my advice. He went to do black seed to the door now. I was joking, man. Where where do you go? Unbelievable. You know, by the way, just I'll tell you this is a true story. By the way, my car is an old car, as you know, and you know I don't want to fix it or you know pay money for it. And you know, I so so what I do, I put some black seed in the gas, and my friend, my car, I think it's a Ferrari. After the black seed, before the black seed, it's a horrible like old car, like you know. After I put the black seed in the gas, the car run like crazy because it's healed, brother. It's healed. He hang up. I mean, look, they have to add tons of words to the statement is made by their prophet or their God supposedly to fix it. 